Begin facing the long edge of your mat in Mountain Pose. To tree pose on the right side, place the sole of your right foot anywhere along the inner edge of the left leg, avoiding the knee joint. Hands to heart in Anjali Mudra. Slow down your breath. Taking your time, move into tree pose on the left side. Release with control. Position your right leg across the left above the knee, then lower by bending the grounded knee to a standing pigeon pose. You can keep your hands on your right leg or bring them together at heart center. Stay long through the back and neck, chest lifted. Release carefully and repeat on the other side. Release and shake out the ankles. Step to a wide stance, arms out at shoulder height to a five-pointed star. Side bend to the right. Then to the left. Back to the right. Last time to the left. Place your hands on your hips, sending them back as you hinge to a fold. Option to step the feet out wider as you place your hands down on the mat. Plant the right palm down center and twist, opening up to the left, left hand reaching up. Release. 
Lower the left hand and twist open to the right, gazing up. Lower the right arm, hands return to your hips, flat back as you return to standing, staying in that wide stance. Turn the left toes out to face the short edge of your mat, transitioning to a warrior two. You can widen your stance if you want to. Make sure that that left knee is facing the same direction as your toes and not turning in. Raise your arms to shoulder height and gaze over your left hand. Keep the chest lifted, shoulders down and back. To a side angle, leaning the upper body to the left, resting the left arm gently on the left leg, keep the right arm down, resting it behind your back, option to rest the right hand in the left hip fold. Come up and straighten the left leg as you reverse your warrior. Arms parallel to the mat, reach the left arm forward and fold to triangle. Bend the left knee and make your way back to warrior two. Straighten the left leg, turn the left foot to face the long edge of your mat, right foot turns out to the right short edge of your mat to warrior two on the opposite side. To a side angle, keep the left arm down, resting it behind your back, option to rest the left hand in the right hip fold. to a straight-legged reverse warrior. Arms parallel to the mat, reach the right arm forward and fold to triangle.
Bend the right knee and make your way back to warrior two. Rotate the right foot and return to a five-pointed star. Inhale, raising the arms overhead. Exhale, lower to goddess. Inhale, straighten up and repeat for a few more goddess pulses. Lower the arms and walk the feet in to just beyond shoulder width apart. Lower to garland pose, hands together. Press your arms into your legs and your legs back into your arms. Make your way to a seated bound angle pose, soles of the feet together. Sit up tall, shoulders down and back, drawing the knees down towards the mat. Release the pressure in your legs and loosen them up. Shift to a tabletop position, then through to downward facing dog. Pedal out the heels if you want to. Extend the right leg to a three-legged dog. Pull the knee in towards your chest as you shift your weight forward five times. Step the right leg to the outside of the right hand to lizard pose. Press into the hips, releasing the right side gently. Lower the back knee and top of the foot and then option to lower to your forearms.
onto your hands, right hand to the outside of the right leg, work your way up, raising the arms to a low lunge. Lower the hands, curl the back toes under and raise the knee. Step the right foot back and make your way to downward facing dog. Raise the left leg to three legged dog, knee pulls five times. Step the left foot to the outside of the left hand to lizard pose. Pressing into the hips, release the left side gently. Lower the back knee and top of the foot and then option to lower to your forearms. Onto your hands, left hand to the outside of the left leg. Work your way up, raising the arms to a low lunge. Lower the hands, curl the back toes under and raise the knee. Step the left foot back to plank. Shift forward and lower your knees. Keeping the arms in close to the body, lower your chest and chin to the mat. Then flow to cobra pose, bending at the elbows if you want to. Press back to child's pose. Come to a tabletop position, knees under your hips, wrists under your shoulders, fingers spread wide, toes pointing straight back and not in towards each other. Begin to flow through cat-cow, moving with your breath if you choose to. Option to hold one pose or the other for longer if it feels good.
to a flat back, begin to rock back and forth, working the wrists. Then side to side. Drawing circles one way. Then the other. Rotate the hands so your fingers face toward you and rock gently front to back. Side to side. Circles. and reverse. Shake it out. Transition to a staff pose seated with your legs extended ahead of you. Inhale arms up overhead. Exhale to a forward fold. Coming back up, draw the left foot to the inside of the right leg. Fold forward to a single leg head to knee pose. Return to seated and repeat on the opposite side. Return to seated in staff pose. Draw the left knee up, hugging it with the right arm and twist to the left, gazing back over the left shoulder. Release and repeat on the opposite side. Keep the back hand close to your body, using it to help you sit up taller.
Release, extending both legs, hands behind your hips. Point the toes and flex the feet, working the ankles. Bend the knees up to windshield wiper legs. Knees up, sit up tall, lifting the chest, drawing the shoulders down and back. Hands behind your knees, make your way to a half boat. Lower the feet and make your way onto your back, arms at your sides. Raise the hips to a bridge pose and hold. Lower the hips and release the left leg out long over to the left side of the mat. Cross the right leg over the left. Raise your arms up overhead, left hand tugging on the right wrist, arching the body and opening up through the right side in a banana pose. Release, stepping your right leg off to the right edge of the mat. Left leg over right. Arms up overhead, right hand tugging on the left wrist, opening up through the left side of the body. Release to Savasana, taking up space on your mat, palms facing up. Take a few minutes to slow down your breath and calm your mind.